Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. And what we have here, this follows when we have a times a, which can be written as a squared. But this here, same thing multiplying, can write this as a raised to the power x or squared equals to 60 on this side. The next step here, this follows when we have a raised to the power m or is to power n. This same thing as a is to power m n. That is this power multiplies and we have a is to power 2x equals to 60 on this side. The next step here, we take the log on both sides. That is we have log a is to power 2x equals to log 60 from here. The next step here, we apply the power law of logarithm when we have log m raised to power p. This same thing as p log m. At this here, we have 2x log 8 equals to log 60 on this side. The next step here, we divide both sides by log 8. That is divide this side by log 8. Also divide this side by log 8. Which implies here log 8 cancel each other. We have 2x equals to log 60 over log 8. The next step here, we can express 60 as 4 times. 15. Then what we have here becomes 2x equals to log 4 times 15 over log 8. Then yeah, this follows the law of logarithm. When we have log a times b, the same thing as log a plus log b. That is yeah, this becomes 2x equals to log 4 plus log 15 over log 8. Then, next step here, we separate this into two fractions. As we have 2x equals to log 4 over log 8 plus log 15 over log 8. Then also here, we can express 15 as 3 times 5. As this, what we have here becomes 2x equals to log 4 over log 8 plus log 3 times 5 over log 8. Then, this also follows the law of logarithm. All we have becomes 2x equals to log 4 over log 8 plus log 3 plus log 5 over log 8. That is, Next step here, we have 2x equals to log 4 over log 8 plus log 3 over log 8 plus log 5 over log 8. That is, next step here, we can write it as 2 times 2 times 2, that's 2 cube. And what we have becomes 2x equals to log, also 4, I'm writing as 2 times 2, that's 2 square. We have log 2 square over log 2 cube plus log 3 over log 2 cube plus log 5 over log 
to Q. Then next step here, you apply the power of log ring. Two comes here, three comes here, three comes here, also three comes here, and we have two x equals to two log two over three log two plus log three over three log two plus log five over three log two then next step here we have log two cancel each other two over three left here that is we have two x equals to two over three plus here we can write it as one over three times log three over log two plus one over three times log five over log two then next step here um, write this applying change of this when we have log a over log b this is the same thing as log a to base b that is what we have here becomes 2x equals to 2 over 3 plus 1 over 3 log 3 base 2 plus also 1 over 3 log 5 base 2 and here we bring this together as one fraction we have 2x equals to the same here as 3 then here we see have 2 then plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 then next step multiply both sides by 1 over 2 multiply this side by 1 over 2 also multiply this side by 1 over 2 that is here 2 cancel each other and we have x equals to here we have 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3 times 2 here yeah, that's 6 that is the value of x here we have 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 6 then let's check here if this satisfies this given problem that is we substitute the value of x here which is x equals to 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 6 then what we have here becomes 8 raised to power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 6 also times 8 raised to power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 6 is it equals to 60 on this side then here we have same base multiplying follows when we have a raised to power n times a raised to power also same power n. This can be written as a raised to power n plus n. That's two n. At this here we have a raised to power two times two plus log three base two plus log five base two all over six. Is it equals to sixty on this side? Then here, yeah, this power multiplies 2 here 1 and 2 here 3. And this becomes 8 raised to the power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3. Is it equals to 60 on this side? That is, here yeah, it can be expressed as 2 raised to the power 3, which is raised to the power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3 
is it equals to 60 on this side then this power multiplies three here cancel each other we have two raised to power two plus log three is two plus log five is two this is equals to 60 on this side then here we apply law of indices that this when we have a raised to power him plus n this same thing as a raised to power him since a raised to power n then here we have 2 raised to power 2 times 2 raised to power log 3 base 2 times 2 raised to power log 5 base 2. Is it equals to 60 on this side? Then here 2 raised to power 2 has 4. Then times here follows when we have a raised to power log b to base a, which is equals to b. That is the same thing as 3 times here we have 5. Is it equals to 60 on this side? Then 4 times 3, 12. And 12 times 5, that's 60. Which is equals to 60 on this side. Left hand side is equals to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude that x equals to 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 6 satisfy this given problem and thank you for watching don't forget the steps subscribe for more video and turn the notification bell share this video give it a thumbs up and put your comment see you next class and bye for now